and friends chapter 1 tracing family history time to think the following are some famous indian personalities who have migrated to other countries write their names find out the reason for their migration one day i asked my grandfather about his family he told me that he lived in a big joint family when he was a child they lived in a rural area of rajasthan after completing his schooling he shifted to delhi for better educational opportunities since then he has been living in delhi riya's grandfather grew up in a big joint family in rajasthan in due course of time most members of his family moved to different places for various reasons riya met all her uncles aunts and cousins after a long time when she visited rajasthan for a family wedding in the same way riya's friend tanya's family also moved from amritsar to various places for different reasons below is tanya's paternal family tree dada dadi papa mummy chacha chachi bua bhaiya tanya cousin cousin migration sometimes people move from one place to another to settle there this is called migration the people who migrate are called migrants most people migrate to other places primarily for the following reasons better or higher education better job opportunities after marriage job transfer nitty gritty some people move to other countries permanently this is called emigration people who move to another country are called emigrants emigrants are people who arrive in a new country and settle there permanently take a break riya wants to know find out about a person in your family or neighborhood who has migrated what were the reasons for him or her to migrate sometimes people are forced to migrate and shift to another places this is called displacement there are many reasons for forced migration natural calamities like floods famines earthquakes tsunamis etc usually result in movement to safer places to save themselves man made calamities like wars and some political decisions also force people to move Partition of India and Pakistan was one such political decision which displaced many people. Sometimes the government breaks the houses built on unauthorized land. This is called demolition. This also displaces people. Construction of industries, dams and flyovers also compels people to move to other places. Sometimes during the construction of a dam the government asks the people living there to leave their homes as the entire place would submerge under water When there is a war people leave their homes to escape from the violence Sometimes they seek shelter in another country Such people are called refugees Impact of migration When people move from one place to another or migrate they have to face many problems it affects their family life children have problems in adjusting in a new environment the elderly of the house are left alone when the younger generation migrates migrants have to adjust to the local language food climate and other cultural changes of the new place migration has many positive aspects also there is an increase in job and educational opportunities cultural integration mixing and cooperation take place between people of different places 
Take a break. Rhea wants to know. Rhea's uncle and his family are shifting to Srinagar from Ahmedabad because he has changed his job. Discuss four ways in which it will affect Rhea's uncle's family. When educated people migrate from one place to another, what impact does it have on the place from where they migrate? How does it affect the place where they migrate? Discuss in class. Changing family structure. When our grandparents were children, women were confined to the house. They remained busy in household chores like cooking food, washing clothes, and taking care of the children in the family. Nowadays, girls are encouraged to pursue higher education. Many of them are professionally qualified. They have started working and go out of their houses frequently. Some even run different types of business. Many young boys and girls go to other cities and countries for higher education or work. They have to leave their families. Whenever a family member moves out of the house, the whole family structure changes. When a girl gets married, she has to leave her rental home and set up a new home with her husband. This also brings a change in her family as well as her husband's family. The birth of a baby also brings a change in the family structure. Nitty-gritty. In some parts of Meghalaya, the husband lives with his wife's family. Take a break. Priya wants to know. What were the changes in your mother's family when she got married? What adjustments did she have to make in her new 